it's Randy T-Bird out here in sunny Arizona Sunday morning 24th of October beautiful morning temperatures in the low 60s mid 60s long sleeve shirt weather but not leather weather yet uh, for those of you who wear leathers all, to, all, all the time well you know more power to you anyway just out for a ride today I was thinking about here uh, as I was gathering some steam and headed north was, uh, what kind of riding do you like to do? Uh, do you like riding in the city? Do you like riding in the countryside? Do you like long rides, short rides? Do you like blasting around town? Uh, do you like uh, riding in industrial areas on the weekends when there's no traffic around? There's a cop. Uh, anyway, you know, I personally, uh, I've been riding, uh, oh my god, close to 45, 46 years, something like that, and uh, 48 years actually when I think about it. Um, I prefer to get out of town as quickly as possible, get away from the, the main traffic and uh, get away from that and all the, the insane. If you ride in a big city like we do have here in Phoenix, um, traffic is insane anymore. Uh, and people are just blind and ignorant and and just uncaring. You know, they don't pay any attention to motorcycles in my opinion. And uh, it's, I don't want to say dangerous. Everything we do is has got some sort of danger to it. But you definitely have to be on your guard a lot more than you do out on the highway. Uh, I prefer to take the routes that get me out of town as quick as possible. On, uh, I do like riding the freeways. Uh, my wife would disagree there. Rather than service streets. I used to enjoy some of the, uh, I want to call them secondary streets here in the, in the Phoenix area. Uh, we have, uh, oh, what the hell is this on the road? Oh my god. A trash can. Well, that ain't no good. Um, <laughs> you got you got that too. You got debris in the highway. Uh, I saw a refrigerator in the middle of the road one time. That scared the hell out of me. Anyway, back to the subject. Um, I liked riding the the secondary roads here in in Phoenix. We have uh, everything set up on a one mile grid, and there was like the half mile streets or the quarter mile streets, and a lot of those streets had a lot less traffic and were more scenic and uh, more fun to ride on and uh, I used to take those a lot on the way to work and everything but they were that was back when I rode to work every single day rain or shine uh, for 25 years all I had was a motorcycle and so uh, yeah literally every day I got a lot of miles as I've gotten older I, I like to pick my spots a little bit more uh, I like ride like like this ride here. I'm going through the south end of the Salt River Reservation, and I like going through the farm country and uh, just areas where there's just not so much urban buildup and blight. Um, I grew up here in Phoenix, and uh, the city has probably quadrupled in size in the oh well, Christ, almost 60 years that I've lived here, and. Uh, when you get into an area like this where they're still wide open, it feels really good. I like it. As you can see, there's not hardly any cars on this stretch of road. And uh, I can relax a little bit and ride and not be constantly on the guard. You know, I ride with some people that uh, uh, they ride really hard and fast everywhere they go. And uh, while that can be fun, sometimes it's nerve wracking. And uh, you know, it's just, you know, when you ride with somebody, too, you like to pair up with somebody that rides a similar way to you, so you're not constantly, constantly screaming around, you know, when, when it's uncomfortable for you, you know, but to each his own, you know, uh, I've got a bike that'll, that'll talk the talk, or, and walk the walk, but, uh, I like to pick my spots, uh, those of you folks that live in the more rural areas, uh, like, if you ever watched the, uh, Smokes video, that guy's got some amazing country roads to ride in right outside his house. I am uh, I'm jealous of that. I, I, I really would 
love to see something like that here. We've got flat and country roads, so then we've got northern Arizona, but northern Arizona is jammed with people on the weekends. The highways are pretty crazy. Still, once you get you know into certain areas, it's nice. There are other areas in rural Arizona that are practically, you know, no traffic at all. You know, it takes a while to get to them. That's that's the thing about Phoenix is that to get to any really good riding, you got you got to ride quite a ways to get just to get there. So that's one thing. Chopper Fett, I watch your videos, and you've got there in Kansas. It seems like it doesn't take you long to get away from from town and JP 1970 uh, up in Nevada it doesn't seem to take but a few minutes to uh, to uh, get away from that that small burg that you live in and you've got some wide open territories I, I've been to northern Nevada and uh, there's definitely some wide open out there so um, some people like riding in the forest some people like riding in the desert I like the desert I, I like the forest too uh, but farm country does it for me. I really like that, you know, and a lot of times the farm company country the There's long straight roads through farm fields to me. That's cathartic. I like that um, Unfortunately with the growth of Phoenix the farm country it seems to be getting farther and farther away from town And you got to go through so much town to get there We've got some lakes here out uh, Canyon Lake out on the far uh, east side and on the uh, Salt River and the traffic out there is horrendous on the weekends with uh, people going to these these uh, chain of lakes that are out there and uh, uh, and again I like avoiding the traffic whenever I can did I mention it's a really nice day it is nice blue sky with wispy clouds the the fall winter pattern is set again we get a lot of that kind of cloud formations this time of year uh, what do we got here uh, somebody got a flat tire or broke down or something oh that's police I don't know what that's about somebody having a bad morning anyway but you know give me your thoughts on uh, what kind of riding you like to do you know uh, I get out here in Arizona we are fortunate we can ride all year round it's a little less comfortable in the uh, summer but uh, right now it's just it's getting to be awesome and uh, uh, our days are getting pretty short here uh, noticing that the Sun is down by 530 now and uh, so it's pretty cool in the past they used to hate when the sun went down early because I couldn't really work on anything or do anything after it got dark but now I have a garage and that's uh, that allows me to mess around but anyway this is Randy T bird out here on a gorgeous Sunday morning I'm going to uh, probably do some more video today see which one uh, so which one we like but this is Randy T bird out in Arizona thank you for subscribing if you haven't please do it's painless and easy just push the image of me and you're subscribed and uh, thank you for watching and sharing and I appreciate it you all have a great weekend bye